hiring a lawyer is uh, is a is a challenging task. Um, and the beauty of the world we live in today is most of the information you need is at least readily available to you. The first step should be, of course, to research the lawyers that you're interested in. And you've got to be careful because uh, everybody's got a website. Um, and so you should pay careful attention to what's on there with a particular eye towards the kind of work that that lawyer has done in the past. Where have they tried cases? How frequently do they try cases? What results have they gotten from juries, not just in settlements? Oftentimes, firms will list all the cases that they've had and all these glorious results. But what you'll find is most of those were settlements. And of course, if you don't know what the case was about, you don't actually know whether that settlement value was, was a fair value for, for that particular case. So that's step one, do your research. Step two is interview your lawyer. Don't let them just interview you, interview them. And here's a, a dirty little secret about what we do as trial lawyers. Most lawyers who tout themselves as trial lawyers don't actually try very many cases. Uh, they settle most of their cases. Now, that's true for a lot of reasons. But one of them is because a lots of lawyers aren't really crazy about having to go into the courtroom. The most important thing you can get from your lawyer, and it's something that we give here at, at Warshower Woodward & Atkins, is the ability uh, to go try a case. Insurance companies and defense lawyers know the members of the bar who are not afraid to look at a jury and ask for fair and just compensation for your case. Those lawyers will invariably do a better job for you and get better results because they're not afraid to try a case.